Racing for on YouTube channel. Guys, as you can see, Motion Race Works just taking over. It's on everybody's fenders, even Nate's moonshine. All right, we're on day two of LS Fest. We got uh, the Elko and Leroy here and Donnie down there. James went ahead and took his car over to one of the vendor booths. James is the number two qualifier in his class right now, so he's chilling. As for Leroy and Mullet, we're not doing great. We're not doing great, but we're up right now with Mullet. I really want to put down a good pass because this is our last uh, trial run and then we have to go straight into the three round circus. All right guys, well we really took the wind out of the sails of the Elko as far as the tune-up goes. But you gotta remember we got springs in our wastegate so even though I turned the boost all the way down, this car being it's got such a big engine and stuff is still gonna make some power. And then the boost will ramp in so I really hope this thing just get off the starting line get down track. That's what we need. Dang, look at that Elko Meaner. Good solid A to B pass. Solid A to B here B. Fast Man. as possible. Track looks a lot better than it did yesterday, but there's also oh, no. hasn't been too many fast, fast. Guys. Also have kind of shoddy tires, which is my fault. You know what they like say. The tires. You don't have that shoddy. on the big job. It does such nice burnouts. It hooks them every time. Spicy. adding in a bunch of power now. Oh, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> as good as your wheel speeds match up, you can use the traction control if you want. Oh. Just in case data you want. Data guy doing the data stuff. <laughs> <with> <laughs> data things. I mean, I don't know. If you want to try it, I don't know. It went perfect. So look at how smooth that boost curve is. Yeah. It was like freaking so slow. I mean, right there we're 18 pounds. All right. So guys, uh, over here on Leroy, since last night things didn't work out, our clutch guy, Kale, from Black Magic Clutches, said that we should take a gram off of each lever and that'll loosen up the clutch basically it's like softening up your converter so hopefully that'll get leroy to just cruise down track we're gonna go no boost controller on this one just turn the car down all the way because it is making way too much steam which has never really been a problem until now this new engine in the 76 millimeter turbos it's just a rowdy so we're gonna turn them down and just try and get them to go a to b just like we did with mullet get some data that was a lot of freedom right there oh, i love this country <laughs> Hell yeah. All right, guys, here's the deal. We're going drifting. We have a drift competition tonight, a top 16 deal. Uh, there's like 30 cars drifting here at LS Fest. A lot of good guys, as we saw last night. But uh, we got to qualify in the top 16 out of about 30 cars. So I'm taking Donnie up there. I get one practice it and then two qualifying solo runs. And then we got to go straight back around the El Camino. So it's getting crazy out here, but we're going to hopefully make something happen. Dude, I'm so pumped up right now, like a freaking water slide on the 4th of July. <laughs> I'm more excited than a 
fat kid at Cheesecake Factory. High pressure situation, dude. Just called Leroy up to the start line. Yeah, so we're getting no warm up for Donnie, just doing the two qualifiers, first rep. Right, hopefully they're good. Better be good, dude. As long as you floor it. Oh, he's gonna floor it. Check it out, all the True Street cars are lined up. We're about to idle all these cars for 15 minutes. This is a seven second car. This, I think this is our main competition right here is this Fox body. And uh, Texas Speed powered, I might add, and Motion Raceworks powered. So here we go, big idle party. James, they said we have to stay in the car. Back in the day, they called these cackle fests. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, zoomies your cars are their cackle. Oh, nice. Start them all before a race. We have to be in the car. So, we'll see, see you later. For 15 minutes, dude. This is <laughs> For the next 15 minutes, we sit and we wait. <laughs> so, we reached 188 degrees. We got fan one on. Water pump's running, and uh, we're just chilling. All right, guys, we're 10 minutes into the idle, and uh, oh, two minutes to go. We're 13 minutes in, maybe. Oil temp 183, trans temp 136, water temp 183. Oil pressure's good. Guess we're good. Yeah. So this is where the situation gets a little weird. The starting line guy is waving me forward, telling me that I've already been disqualified from the pass for the tree air. I'm like, hell no, I'm making a pass. So I went ahead and tried to make a pass, spun anyway, and then turns out we got DQ'd later 
when we got back because James wasn't supposed to be on the starting line, which is something they told me in the driver's meeting, but I forgot to tell James. So James lined me up like normal. Didn't even think about it. And uh, all around a tough break situation, we got DQ'd on the first pass for uh, not knowing the rules, but also kind of a weird tree error. So the Elko is out. Oh, they're not allowed to go on the line. She did say that. Yeah, no, no throwing in the burnout box. Okay, so we got DQ'd for James helping me too. <laughs> well, I remember him saying in the driver's meeting that you weren't, like, we weren't allowed to have crew on the starting line, but I completely forgot about that. Or I would have been like, get out of here. I was I like, oh, know. sweet, James is lining me up. I didn't know, I would have just stood there and filmed. <laughs> oh, idiots. It it's always us that mess something up. Sitting fourth in the class. Haven't floored it yet. Yeah, you have to keep letting off. She's been trying. Finesse well, the, of the, the first pass of the weekend, she went right down. No finesse, right? No. Oh, you still had to pedal that one even? Damn. Did you add any weight to the front, or are you just trying to? Uh, every weight I've brought, on my nose. <laughs> All right, so just hopefully you can keep it floored on yeah, this run. So I power management in a spot where it wants to climb. Yeah. Hopes I can just floor through it with a little bit more weight on the nose. Okay. So. That 500, though, not bad. Yeah, but it's faster hot rod. Yeah, let's get it. Let's see a four second eight, dude. Come on. It's coming. Make it happen. So I'm gonna be able to floor this time. I think the track's getting better too. Sun's yeah. going down. I heard some people hooking up, so. Yeah, there's a, some dude did a dreidel out there. Oh, really? Reverse suspension was wild. Oh, dang. Yeah, he's on a lick and the reverse suspension broke. Damn. So that's well, what they're doing now. But hopefully we can get this down and get Leroy down and call it a day. Yeah, it's gonna be, a, it's gonna, that should go. Track's gonna be tight. Okay, cool. Be I don't know if you heard, but uh, your boy Don, he qualified fifth in drifting. Oh, top five. <laughs> don't know how we pulled that one off. Top five. Yeah, right, we'll take it, dude. It really does get down. There comes the jack stand. Dang, look at that thing all polished up. Sheesh. All right, guys, back in the lanes for Q3. But still have yet to floor it. So I'm hoping that this pass, I'm able to floor it, change a little bit in the tune for power management also hung my last weight bar I had brought with me on the nose so got every ounce of weight I brought I think I'm up to close to 300 pounds of lead on the front of this car which is a lot and uh, we're gonna see what it can do maybe it'll stay down maybe I'll get a little bit better trying to go for a four anything right on this pass so being able to floor it will be a big deal of that all right it's real nice out now late in the day Nova's getting a rip, Leroy's getting a rip here in a few. Help goes out, tough break. That's a nice hit right there. Here we go, James. All right, it's his last wall. We're changing the name from Wilson. Jack Stand to Wheel Stand. <laughs> Love <Get> it. Boy. <laughs> Dang! Savage, baby! Oh, yeah. 
this pass right here. Dang, look at Leroy. It's so mean. know how much of a bad unit Leroy is spun the tires right and then on 12 pounds of boost Leroy went at 8.5 at 164 12 pounds of boost let's see what the max number was because through most of the gears it was about 12.2 but I think okay we touched max value 13.1 this thing's making so much more power. All right, so now we gotta figure out how to get power out of the launch because it's only launching on three pounds of boost. So that leads me to believe maybe the clutch is still too tight, you know, because that's not that much power. I mean, I guess it could be a bunch. I don't really know. So we'll see here. Um, we're gonna take a look. Oh, <laughs> they already, they already spawned the second one. The tire wrinkled. Go away the next resolution. The car didn't even move yet, the tire's already up. So, take a little weight off it. You know, that's where you pedal it. Damn. Dude, you're boy in fifth. How do you feel about that? That was a pretty good run, dude. Solid run. I was just wrong, ripping it. This is going to be crazy. Dude. Who got first? Oh, Dirk did. Yeah, Dirk. I went, ripped it, dude. I went against ripped. it last year. He destroyed my life. He was just like <laughs> on my door. Where's uh, Jonathan Cash? Oh, there he is, number two. Ooh. Here at the LSS Drift Competition. We got Donnie. I know that it's Somehow, we qualified fifth. And there was 30 plus drift cars out here that are pretty insane. And uh, there are some pros in the class. So Donnie's dialed. We're ready to do this. All right, guys. First round, we got LSS 14. What you got under there? Anything good? S13. Oh, S13. You got anything hidden under here? Any nitrous? No nitrous. Sweet, dude. Good looking car. Good luck. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Let's rip it. All right. Well, let's do this, boys. We're leading first. What a beast.
the chase. Yeah, that was rad. The results might be in. I won. All right, we good. Woo! We're moving on, boys. Well, that was some driving. Dude, I was scared that I messed up. Like, but I think I was mad. Like, close that would be. I lose to a Pro 1 FD driver. Best case, I beat a Pro 1 FD driver. Oh, yeah. oh snap. for his money oh yeah dude i you screwed up when i was chasing him i had a pretty good run you just need a little more that was fun dude i jumped him so bad when i was chasing dude oh yeah you have to though i know i had to he's so fast yeah 